After years of cameos, Donkey Kong makes a triumphant return to the console. But as we catch up with DK and sidekick Diddy, we find all is not well in this island paradise. The dormant volcano has blown its top, releasing evil tikis who hypnotize the animals, forcing them to steal all the bananas. Now it's up to Kong and Diddy to get them back. Those of you who played the Donkey Kong games back in the SNES in 64 days will feel right at home with Donkey Kong Country Returns. The game is eerily familiar with many of the same gameplay mechanics, but some new twists have been added. As you make your way around the island, you'll find DK can now interact with his environments. You can blow on dandelions, snuff out lanterns, even pound the ground to reveal all sorts of goodies. Sometimes new paths can be opened up into the background, letting you explore secret areas. This gives some added depth to the linear levels, creating interesting and fun gameplay. <laughs> the game is tough. You can easily blow through 20 to 30 lives on a single level, especially if you try and find all the hidden items. Fortunately, Cranky Kong is there to help. Cranky is more than willing to sell you some extra lives and other bonus items, and he's not the only Blast from the past willing to lend a hand. Ramby also makes a return to help you through levels and open up additional secret paths. While the single player game is a blast, two players are able to team up and play together. One controls DK, the other Diddy. Diddy can shoot his peanut gun and acts as a second set of hands to help collect stuff hidden through the levels. And when the going gets tough, he can jump on DK's back for a free ride. If you both get stuck, you can activate the Super Guide and watch Super Kong finish the level for you. He won't collect bonus items, but he will open up the path to the next level. The game is visually impressive, as is the music. It's an incredible looking game for the Wii, one of the best there is. Controls are precise for the most part, with the exception of the barrel roll, which shares a similar controller action as the blow command, and that can lead to a few cheap deaths. Despite the difficulty and occasional control issue, Donkey Kong Country Returns will receive well-deserved fanfare. This romp through an island's paradise is soaked in nostalgia, and the new features make it a worthy follow-up. The review crew gives Donkey Kong Country Returns a 9.5 out of 10.